bitten by bug leader of anti-lockdown group that organized protests tests positive. A leader of an anti-lockdown group that protested shutdowns in North Carolina has tested positive. Audrey Whitlock of Reopen NC revealed that she has contracted the virus but has not shown any symptoms. Whitlock complained that her forced self-quarantine violated her First Amendment rights. The reality is that modern society has not been able to eradicate contagious viruses, she wrote on Facebook. A typical public health quarantine would occur in a medical facility. I have been told not to participate in public or private accommodations as requested by the government, and therefore denied my First Amendment right of freedom of religion. She added, it has been insinuated by others that if I go out, I could be arrested for denying a quarantine order. The Peaceful Action Group, which launched earlier this month, boasts of 70,000 members. We stand for the Constitution, the organization wrote. We are mostly business owners and employees that are losing our income and denied our right to provide for our families. About 1,000 protesters gathered in Raleigh last week to ask Democratic Governor Roy Cooper to lift the state's stay-at-home order. Cooper has extended the order through May 8, and has said that public schools will be closed until August, according to the Charlotte Observer. Reopen NC organized the protest, which included Republican Representative Dan Bishop among the throng. Bishop was seen with a copy of the Constitution, and hand sanitizer, according to the newspaper.